looting of root posts with dual curing or self curing composites. The following sequence demonstrates how a root post is fixed with a dual curing looting composite. The endodontically treated tooth that was previously filled with gutta percha and the sealant has been prepared for the fixation of a root post. The root channel filling was removed with a drill corresponding to the root post in diameter. The root channel is then cleaned by rinsing it with water, remaining water is removed with a paper point. The length of the root post is adjusted to the root channel and, after disinfecting the root post with alcohol, it is coated with ceramic bond. The coupling silent agent has to operate on the surface for 60 seconds. After that, solvents are removed by drying the surface with air. In the meantime, the single dose blister is activated and opened and the adhesive is applied coronally and rubbed in for 20 seconds. For application in the root channel, a special applicator, Endotim, is used to also rub in the adhesive for 20 seconds. Remaining adhesive in the root channel is removed with a paper point. Light curing the adhesive is not useful since the specific geometry of the root channel doesn't allow light to penetrate the root channel until its bottom. Furthermore, the root channel might tighten. Especially in the coronal area of the root channel, the fitting accuracy of the root post will be negatively affected if surpluses of the adhesive material are light cured. Since Futura Band U is dual curing, the chemical curing in the root channel is guaranteed even without a polymerization lamp. After the bonding step, a looting composite is applied into the root channel. If a quick mix syringe is used for the first time, a bleeding step is mandatory to even up the filling levels of both chambers and to ensure a one-to-one -one mixing ratio. The Builder DC is applied with an endodontic cannula that fits perfectly into the root channel. To prevent air bubbles, the tip of the mixing cannula must be inserted deeply and always remain inside the material. Then the silane coated root post is inserted into the root channel. The composite surplus inflicted by squeezing out the material is then light cured initially to fix the root post coronally.